Hello and welcome to your Reiki session. For tonight's session, our intention is bringing in blessings of luck and good fortune and abundance, really calling in the energy of blessings. And this is a Reiki energy healing. All you need to do to receive this energy is to open yourself to receive it. So allowing yourself to receive, you can say that out loud, say it inside, just generally opening yourself up to the receiving. Any of those ways work. And I like to use crystals in my Reiki sessions and I will introduce those to you now, okay? And if you're new here, my name is Bree, and I go by Tip of the Moon um, pretty much everywhere on the internet, also on Instagram, and I am on TikTok. I do live healing sessions on TikTok three times a week, and I realize I should probably talk about that stuff more because sometimes people show up in my TikTok lives and they're like, oh, I follow you on YouTube. I had no idea you did this. So if you would like to join me in any of those places or interested in any of my other work, there are always links in the description box down below but I am a Reiki master teacher and I make content and classes on Patreon here, all kinds of places. So um, there's more if you're interested. Um, let's get into it and I will show you some of the crystals. So one of the first stones I have is this big chunk of uh, pyrite. And this is so good for um, strength and determination and this kind of turning action into manifestation, giving a lot of motivation to our energy. And it's quite sparkly. And after that, I have this little sunstone point. And this is so lovely to bring in. There, it's so sparkly. Um, just brings in this beautiful energy of the sun, that sort of luck and beauty and grace that is a sunbeam, um, just bringing in that cleansing and clearing ability that sunshine has, abundance and luck. And then I have a small little piece of aventurine, and this is one of my favorite luck stones, it's why I have this little coin sized piece because it feels so tiny and lucky but it has that attraction and enhancing ability for luck, um, sort of enhancing the luck you have and that um, attracting opportunities, attracting that balancing energy of bringing in good blessings into your life. And then one of my most favorite stones, Celestial Quartz. Uh, this is quite a sparkly and clear piece, but celestial quartz has this beautiful divine connection, brings in the energy of enlightenment and expansion and transformation, um, really bridging worlds, going kind of interdimensional, um, opening you up to messages from the divine, from your guides, from your angels, has a beautiful connecting energy to it. I have a little incense and smoke here, and a feather. Just bringing this smoke, this cleansing smoke, all over your energy, clearing out your space, clearing out my space, making sure that this place that we're meeting in, your energy and my energy, is clear. It also gives us a moment to start to settle into the session. Letting go of distractions. Coming here into this present moment, 
yourself to just let go of those things, to release any unwanted thoughts or emotions, starting to instead check in with your body, getting yourself comfortable. Allowing yourself to feel a little clearer, a little more light. It's kind of like prepping a canvas before you paint on it. We want to kind of bring ourselves to center before we start to layer in energy. Just gonna put the incense to the side for a moment and work with this feather and just pushing down through the energy.
Okay, so a little feather to kind of cleanse us out and start us off. Alright, I'm going to bring in pyrite now. Bring in, um, we're kind of building ourselves a base in our energy body for strength and determination and focus on bringing in this luck these blessings as we call in that energy of blessings and luck we want to feel really confident in our call confident in our ability to move our energy towards luck and blessings into good fortune calling that energy in feeling strong and motivated using this pyrite in our lower chakras, sending energy to our root, our sacral, our solar plexus, kind of building us a solid foundation. As we bring this energy into our lower energy body, perhaps allowing yourself to embody the idea of good luck. Like when you imagine yourself being lucky, or full of good fortune, what does that feel like in your body? How could you connect to that energy feeling right now, here in this session? Really aligning your your body, your physical body, with the feeling of luck, with the feeling of blessings. Perhaps calling to mind a time when you felt lucky, or you felt blessed, or imagining what it would feel like to feel lucky or blessed.
just really breathing in that strength and foundational energy, allowing your breath to travel down into the root, into the sacral, to the solar plexus, connecting with the energy of strength and manifestation. So that is pyrite, sorry, you can see it more back here. Um, pyrite, very sparkly, um, actually quite heavy stone as well. Um, that's probably why I don't use it that often. <laughs> A little heavy. And um, I'm going to bring in this sunstone point, and this is so lovely for just um, that beautiful energy of the sun. If you've ever experienced that like first sunny day of spring and how that um, warmth can just reinvigorate your soul that brings in this sort of cleansing energy that burns off all that stagnation of winter that's the energy we're trying to capture with this sunstone point really feeling our body feeling our core energy up with this beautiful abundance feeling that transformation that happens when we feel sun when we feel warm and blessed really calling that energy into the core of our being, working with the energy channels all the way up and down. From the top of the head, all the way through the torso. allowing ourselves to be filled with this light. So many times we will push away luck and blessings because we are worried that if we take something good, then something bad will happen. So allowing yourself to fill with this energy of blessings, of luck, good fortune, opportunities. And as it goes into the core of your being, it radiates warmth into the rest of the energy body, filling you. Taking a moment here to center in on that feeling, allowing your breath to integrate this luck, this energy we're calling in, allowing your breath to just really anchor that feeling into the body, into your spirit, into your energy. allowing that energy of um, luck and blessings to transform your life, your words, your habits.
perfect. Feels much better. Sunstone point, so you can see the flash there. Um, sunstone in general has a wonderful energy. I wouldn't mind like a necklace or a pendant with that. Um, such a beautiful energy. I'm bringing in this green aventurine. This um, feels like it um, attracts and um, enhances the luck and good fortune you already have, bringing in more, kind of like a, a magnet, sort of taking what little bit of fortune you have and using it to and amplify it and, and attract more. Um, so it is one of my favorite lucky stones, personally. And there's a bit of balance to it too. It is not just like overwhelming. It feels soft, like the color of this is like sagey. And it's a very smooth kind of stone with not too much bling in it. It's really just honestly, it can almost be a piece of plastic. Like there's not much to the look of it. It doesn't need to be flashy. It can be really grounded in that balanced sense of luck. Like, luck doesn't need to be winning the lottery. Um, luck and good fortune and blessings, sometimes they're just noticing or connecting more deeply with something we already have. It's noticing the beautiful clouds in the sky, the birds singing outside of your office. Like, we can call in and attract that just by sort of being balanced in our approach to blessings. attracting that really lovely balanced energy filling in our energy body with all of that enhancing attracting And as we interact with this energy of the green of entering, perhaps calling to mind or thinking of ways that you could bring in more blessings to your day, which ways could you notice blessings already in your life? like looking in all the crooks and crannies of our life and finding those little glimmers of good things. A nice view on the way to work. Kindness from a stranger. Something funny that made you laugh. that we notice and bring our awareness to and enhance those moments of blessings, of luck, of good things, the more we attract 
more of that. Be sort of tuning in and focusing. It's like focusing a radio on a certain band or frequency. The more that we turn ourselves towards that, noticing blessings, noticing good fortune, noticing the joy, the more we tune in to more of it. Really filling in all the small spaces in your energy with this beautiful green aventurine energy. It's kind of like um, putting on a nourishing face mask, like allowing it to soak into every little space. It kind of is the color of a face mask, too. It honestly looks a little like jade. Beautiful. Okay, so that was some green adventuring. Um, lastly, I have this celestial quartz, and we're just going to use this to kind of spark some divine connection, really calling in those blessings from above, from outside of ourselves, tapping into that energy of enlightenment, the energy of expansion and transformation. It really has this high vibrational energy to it that feels like it's bridging um, worlds, like interdimensional kind of speaking with the divine. I'm just going to bring you in a little closer so we can just really sort of draw this on your outer aura. Sort of like embroidery or engravings, little etchings on your energy for good luck for blessings and good fortune. Little sparkles on your outer aura. Little Reiki symbols. Little sparkles of the divine. Sort of bedazzling your outside energy.
allowing yourself to feel blessed, allowing that energy to settle on your skin, like little sparkles. Feeling infused with that divine energy of blessings, calling in more, calling in luck, sharing your blessings and good fortune so that it may spread. Just all of those divine blessings, like little sparkles on your skin, allowing them to soak in, allowing yourself to feel good, feel optimistic and blessed. feels so much lighter and better. The celestial quartz. So I'm just gonna um, brush through your energy for a moment. Integrating everything. Like your energy feels much brighter and blessed and so I hope that this energy brings you all the luck and blessings um, life has to offer. Thank you so much for joining me in this session today. Um, I appreciate you all so much for trusting your energy in this space. 
here are some of the ways that you could support my channel. Really um, appreciate your subscription and comments. They are always so lovely. And um, there are links in the description box below for all of my other social media stuff. And yeah, I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.